Hi, I'm Renjani Rangan, Product Marketing Engineer for Charm Health. Today, we will be talking about the integration of Fullscript with Charm Health. We are so excited to have so many of you attending today. Thank you for being here. Uh, just a quick intro. Uh, for those of you who aren't familiar with Fullscript, it is an online dispensary. It gives you access to thousands of professional grade supplements to recommend to patients, and you don't need to carry an inventory. In addition to earning revenue from supplement sales and refills, many practices are able to reduce their overhead and provide clients with a convenient venue to get their supplements. Today, I will be introducing to you Hala, our Full Scripts expert. Um, hi, Hala, are you there? Yes, I am. Hi, Ranjani. Can you hear me? Yes, I can hear you. Great. Thank you so much for being with us today. Absolutely. Um, Hala will take you through the details of what Fullscript can do for your practice and how to integrate Fullscript and Charm. Thank you so much, Ranjani, for the introduction. I'm going to also be sharing my screen so that everyone can see the tutorial. I know we may have a lot of Fullscript users joining us today. But for those of you who don't know Fullscript, I'm going to be doing a quick overview. Ranjani gave a wonderful introduction to Fullscript actually, but I wanted to recap with a few pointers. Through Fullscript, you can reduce your current overhead. You may be spending on inventory. You can provide your patients with a convenient venue to get their supplements since Fullscript ships their supplements directly to their door. And you can earn revenue from supplement sales and refills. In today's webinar, I'll be going through what the Fullscript and Charm integration is, how to set it up, how to use it, how to become more efficient in using the integration, and the updates that will be made recently or have been made. First up, what is the Charm Fullscript integration? As you may know, if you have other venues of dispensing, supplements, your workflow can sometimes be convoluted with duplicate steps because you would have had to write up your supplement recommendation for your patient and then separately copy that information into your chart or vice versa. By integrating your supplement dispensary and your charting service, you can pretty much do everything in one step. Within your chart, you can search for supplements you want to recommend and send those off to your patients. Again, all in one step. So Fullscript integrates with Charm to provide you with an optimized and more streamlined solution to charting and dispensing supplements. It's extremely easy to set up and to use. We're going to get started with the tutorial on how to set it up. I'm logged into my Fullscript Practitioner account here. To use the integration, you must first have a Charm account and a Fullscript account. Signing up for Fullscript is free, and you can do so at fullscript.com. In your Fullscript account, the first step to integrating is to create a unique code or clinic key that we will then insert into our Charm account. So on your Fullscript account, you would hover over your name, go to dispensary settings, then go to integrations. And at the very bottom, use the drop down menu to select charm and create. Now what this does is it generates a clinic key, which we will select and copy. And then we'll need to insert this into our Charm account by clicking on add-ons, going into the Fullscript widget, confirming that we do have a Fullscript account, and pasting our clinic key here. Click check to verify your code. This allows you to select your account and click update. If you have multiple uh, providers here on Charm, they will be listed over here, and you will need to match them to their associate Fullscript accounts. 
If your providers are not enrolled in Fullscript, you can click on Enroll this member in Fullscript, and this would add them to your already existing Fullscript account. Now, of course, I'm enrolled in Fullscript. I'm going to go ahead and select myself and click Associate. Now that it's set up, we're ready to begin recommending supplements straight from a charm encounter. So let's say we're here and we want to go ahead and search for a patient that we want to recommend supplements for. We're going to go into an encounter, create a new encounter. Whichever type of encounter you select will give you the opportunity to recommend supplements. I'm going to go ahead and click create. Now within the charts here, you can add any of your charting content that you need. If you do want to recommend supplements, under the supplement tab, there's going to be a button to add supplement. And now a full script button should appear here, which will allow you to search the full script catalog. The trick to navigating this search is to search for the exact product name as you know it. So for example, cortisol manager. There you, there you go, and we can go ahead and click prescribe. You're able to add in the dosing instructions as you see fit for the patient and click add. Um, if you do have a product that has a bit more of a common name, such as, you know, B-Complex, what you're able to do to select exactly what you're looking for is to filter by the brand. So let's say orthomolecular. There you go, and we're able to prescribe here. Same idea, you're able to add in your dosing instructions as you see fit here. Um, one of the new improvements to the CHARM integration is the ability to view product descriptions, ingredients, and suggested dosage instructions. This is available by clicking on this product name here. Now this information has always existed on Fullscript. Um, very recently, Charm was able to import this content into your eChar. And you're also able to see product availability and pricing as well. We're gonna go ahead and add this one. Another new search feature in this integration is the ability to find all products by a specific brand. So if you're looking for, let's say, all the products for Designs for Health, you're now able to find everything that we carry by that brand and are able to then select the one that you choose. So there we have it. I'm going to add in, again, same idea with dosing. You're able to find your dosing and add it. Another tip here that I would suggest to speed up this process or increase efficiency in recommending supplements in Charm is to create templates that you would then find here in the templates tab. Then you're able to select all the products from within your template or your protocol or maybe some of the products here and automatically add all of them. So this speeds up the process. You're not having to search for each product every single time. You can connect with me or the Charm team after this webinar. If you needed a walkthrough on how to exactly create these templates within your Charm account, which is available in, in the settings section of your Charm. Um, and there you have it. So we have added in all the supplements that we want. All we need to do now is transmit these products into the Fullscript account. What this will do is then send a patient an email with their products and how to order them. To transmit, you simply click transmit, select full script. You will need to select this checkbox to check off all the supplements that you want to transmit and click send. And now that the supplements are queued, they'll be transmitted electronically in a few moments. 
Um, if you do already uh, have a full script account, you might realize that there are a few features you're used to when putting in recommendations on full script that you cannot see within the integration. For example, applying discounts for the patients. All of this is coming. Um, the updates that I have been told are coming are the ability to give patient discounts from within your charm chart, uh, the ability to load up the categories and templates you would have created created on full script prior to the integration. This way you're not having to redo some of these protocols again. And as well, the ability to send patients text reminders versus just email. Um, so that would be it on my end and I'm beginning, uh, I'm ready actually to start taking questions. Thank you so much, Hala, for that. That was very nice. Um, I have a few questions that I wanted to start off with, and I wonder if you could help me answer. Absolutely. Um, yeah, so some of our CHARM users are wondering, what exactly do the patients receive after they transmit the supplements through CHARM? Uh, do they get a confirmation message that a patient received their email? Yeah, absolutely. So what the patients receive exactly is an email coming from Fullscript. As soon as the recommendation is transmitted to Fullscript, an email is sent. Uh, it mentions the practitioner's name in the subject line. So the patients know what to expect. They know this is content coming in from their practitioners. Once they open that email and uh, click on the link to order, uh, a confirmation notification is saved on the practitioner's account on Fullscript. Script. So at any point in time, a practitioner can actually log into their full script account and click on a specific patient to see if they have uh, viewed the email, logged in, and even ordered. What number do we call to get more information about both Charm and full script? Um, so definitely in terms of full script, I would direct you to our support team, support at fullscript.com. Um, as well for Charm, it's uh, support at charmhealth.com. Uh, phone numbers here, we do have a support phone number, uh, which we can have, uh, it's 1-866-807-3828. Pertaining to the integration specifically, you can email me direct at hala at fullscript.com, and I am able to answer questions about the integration with charm um, and Min minimal charm uh, questions as well. Uh, we can also still enter supplements that are not currently carried by full script. That is correct. Um, so that is a question from one of our attendees. Um, uh, through full script, you are able to add supplements as part of inventory. Um, and so you're able to add those separately into that supplement section, as well as full script uh, supplements that are then transmitted. And the patient will then obviously pay for your in-office inventory through the CHARM uh, platform. Um, let's see, I frequently update a patient prescription in full script when I add or delete a supplement for them. Uh, can this be done in CHARM or does each transmission generate a new prescription? So. Right now, each transmission does generate a new prescription. In terms of editing or changing a specific transmitted prescription, you can do so on full script. So you can log back into full script and change or update the information there. Um, there is no bi-directionality at this point where we can push that information back to Charm with an updated recommendation. But this is something that we are working on. Uh, hopefully bi-directionality will come soon. So anything that you do change will be kind of migrated over to Charm or even the ability to edit current prescriptions or current transmitted prescriptions through Charm. If favorites are available from full script to Charm, I think this one is coming too. What's going to happen is we're going to import the template feature first. So templates will be visible through Charm. And then soon after, your favorites. So these categories that you build in full script will shortly after be available through Charm. And you're able to then select from them and not have to search for them every time. And some of the other updates are, as I was saying, the discount feature, the discount option, which will allow you to then add a discount to the patient from within your Charm account as well. 
So I have a new patient, new patient instruction template that I use in Fullscript to explain to them about reordering uh, or ordering other items that I haven't explicitly recommended. Is there a way to have this type of template included? I see what you mean. So uh, including the type of template on Fullscript, we have a type of template that includes a message section where you're able to add any sort of details, uh, you know, such as explanation, so on and so forth. Um, for now, uh, this information is not saved on Charm as a template. There's no message section in the Charm template. Uh, but when we do, when we are able to import the templates from Fullscript, I'm going to make sure that the Charm team knows to also import the the message section uh, or include this as a, as part of the Charm integration, so that when you do use this template, it shows up. Uh, on full script with the message section. Another one here, um, the repeat previous encounter to start a new visit. Will the same supplements be carried over in the next chart? No. Um, so actually I was doing some testing on that specific feature. Um, basically when you repeat the previous encounter, you can select whether you want the recommendation section to be repeated. If you did select it to be repeated, it will show the full script products there, but you should be able to delete them and change them up. So it's, it's repeated, but it's not transmitted again. Uh, you should be able to make changes, edit, add, delete. And if that's not the case on your end, let us know uh, because I was testing it the other day and it was working for me, so it should be. Does transmission from Fullscript automatically add the patient to Fullscript? Yes, it does. So we don't need to separately add the patient in Fullscript. Absolutely, that's one of the advantages of the integration. The fact that you are you don't need to add the the patient on full script again you don't need to create the recommendation again as uh, soon as you transmit a prescription to a patient with supplements that are coming from full script it adds them in there adds their name and email and sends them that email for them to place the order does it pull the phone number? So phone number actually does not pull, uh, not just yet. This is something that's actually going to be in the most recent update to come. Uh, it's, go it's going to also be pulling in phone numbers to allow for that text reminder to be sent to the patients and not just an email. Right now, it's just name and email that gets pulled over from Charm to Fullscript. So yes, yeah, soon phone numbers are coming. Wow, thank you so much, Hala. I appreciate your time and taking all the, uh, you know, effort to answer these questions. Uh, it was very clear and concise. I really appreciate it. Um, it. Looks like we had a lot of interest and I appreciate all the attendees joining us today for this integration of Fullscript with Charm Health. Uh, once again, as Hala mentioned, um, we are here to answer any of your questions that did not get answered and you are free to email us at those two emails, um, support at charmhealth.com and hala at fullscript.com to you know, further go, if you want to go a little deeper, ask any other questions. And um, thank you so much for joining us and um, have a wonderful day.